For years, monsters have been sealed away by a powerful spell. A spell that could only be broken with seven human souls. The king was peaceful and wished to avoid any more conflict, but eventually declared that any human who fell would die. Prequel to Undertale. Undertale Yellow. Been in development for seven years. Finally just released. Oh my god, look at the running animation! It looks so good! No flowey. Froggit didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. Hey! What? The mysterious goat lady scared the froggit away. Uh, hello. Are you alright? You must be wondering what is going on. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through here every day to see if anyone has fallen down. It does not happen often. You are the first to come here in a long time. Do not be afraid, little one. I will do my best to protect you here. Come, I shall guide you through your new home. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. They must be solved in order to move from room to room. Allow me to demonstrate. Wow. Next level. We are free to proceed now. Follow me, my child. There are more puzzles ahead. In this room, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry. I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Is it... Is it this one? Splendid. I am proud of you, my child. Oh no, my child. That is the wrong switch. I have labeled the one you need to flip. Wow, I did it. It should have opened by now. I am sure I labeled the correct lever. Ah, uh, do not worry, little one. Try flipping the other switch. What? My child. Are you all right? Oh dear, I am afraid I cannot reach you. Fret not, my child. I will protect you. Please, wait there. I was wondering when we would deviate. Appar apparently now? What was that? I'm alive! Let's go! I wonder if you just wait there if Toriel ever shows back up. That would be interesting. Howdy, I'm Flowey the Flower. Hmm, you look confused. Toriel ought to have taught you how things work around here. She didn't? I guess little old me will have to do that. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul. The very culmination of your being. Your level represents love. It's... <laughs> I'm sure you won't have to worry about that. In the underground, monsters may try to attack you. If you see bullets like these, you need to avoid them at all costs. Try dodging my bullets now. Here they come. Nice job there, buddy. In case you do get hit, I can save your progress. That means if something bad happens, I can make it unhappen for you. Huh? <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> you probably want to go home, don't you? Well, you've got a long journey ahead. If you ever need to save, come look for me. I'll leave these little things around for you. That way, it's easy to find me. If you see one, don't hesitate to give me a call. And then I'll save for you, like I just saved for you now. There's one more thing. The king of all monsters, Asgore, he's been killing humans. The only way out is killing him, and well, you're pretty small. That doesn't matter too much, though. What matters is you've got me on your side. I'll let you get going, but please be careful. There's all sorts of dangerous traps down here, and some of the monsters in this place, I hear they don't like visitors. So good luck. I am a bit suspicious. Flowey's never that nice. Flyer is giving fighting a try. <laughs> Yippee! <laughs> 
You inform Flyer that his life isn't half over. He has a whole half left to go. I... This isn't really me. Flyer is ready to return to his regular life. <laughs> Wait. There's something to do? Oh! I love the movement. The movement in the attack window feels really smooth. Everything has that new car smell with a faint whiff of body spray. Oh, you're wearing axe. Maybe we do have to fight. I'll spare you because I'm a good person right now. Make what is dim bright. Make what is dark light. Private property, no trespassing. Violators will be towed. <laughs> ah, yes, that's not ominous at all hello i'm happy to finally meet you face to face how long has it been i was wondering if you'd ever come back no too forward who am i kidding i'll never be able to meet you in this state i just hope you know i had no choice it must be this way huh who uh I must be seeing things. Well, that was a rootin' tootin' disaster of a confrontation. <gasps> oh, fighting again. Uh, Penilla. Penilla. <laughs> Hello. You compliment Penilla's work. She looks a little uncomfortable. You're just saying that because you feel obligated. I don't really think it's ready for people yet. You put yourself in between Vanilla and her work. I suppose I could use a break. Hey, speed, nice. Interesting. Okay, Flowey's offering his help to go through the quote-unquote weirdo? I don't know, man. Sweet corn hops up excitedly. This hits a little bit different when the sweet corn is a sentient be being. Like, what are you- how are you gonna take that exactly? All you can taste is sugar. Whatever makes you happy. What a sweet little monster. I would never do anything violent. You give sweet corn a big hug. She briefly gets stuck to your shirt. Hey, we spared the sweet corn. What a sweet corn. Where am I supposed to- Oh, the switches. I see. Nice! Friends, do not fear the unknown. Sometimes they're nice. Okay, well, we're gonna go back then. A little pile of conveniently bullet-shaped pebbles. Take them? Yeah! You joking? Of course. Interesting. It's- all these bridges are broken, and I'm not totally sure why. Is it wrong to hold doubt in my actions? I enjoyed life before. I did. But I can't go back. What happens that day would only repeat. What is this? Why do they appear every time I start monologuing? I need more rest. Howdy! Golly, this place sure is dead. All the monsters are quiet and lurking. That's not like monsters at all. Don't let this ruin your impression of the underground. We'll leave this dumb behind soon enough. I got 21 gold to my name, baby. Why did everything go dark? Hey, bud. Oh, Desabat makes his presence known. Mm, watch. You watch Desabat in silence. He seems to appreciate it. Don't move. Don't make a sound. Hush, hush. Yeah. You shout and jump around trying to scare Desabat away. He isn't pleased. Shh. I'm just. <laughs> He's so mad. I'm like, 
progressively pissing him off more and more. Oh my god. Shaking with anger. You shout and jump around. Hush, hush, hush. Sweet silence. <laughs> So you're aware still, yeah, all right. It's one of these puzzles, eh? Hey, we're gaming here. What's this? You jostle the gate, it doesn't budge. Okay. That's fake. Look at me gaming here. It says, I seem to recall what I once saw so often. What I remembered, it seems, is now forgotten. So then never mind, I guess. A quill, or a feather. It's a feather that I cannot interact with for some reason. It's a stray feather. Take it? Yeah. Hmm. Um... Okay, what's happening here? Oh! Cutscene... Hello! Do we have to fight? Uh, um... I don't know who you are, but I ask you, please leave. No. Property of Dalf, that monster in the cloak. No trespassing. Oops. Not too far now. You just gotta deal with that downer. Then you're out of the ruins. See you on the other side, pal. Okay. We're gonna explore. Hello, corn. Don't step on the flowers. Fuck you. I'll step on the flowers if I want to. Interest. Oh, it's. There's a corn dog. <laughs> Take the corn dog. Let's go. <laughs> You're still following me. I thought I made it clear that I want to be left alone. I don't understand you. You look just like them. Is this some sort of haunting or have you come to finish the job? Retreating here wasn't enough, so you hunted me down, right? What? And I was just starting to accept my reality, the cruelty. Whatever I did to you that day was not my intention, I was only... Never mind, words aren't enough. I... I don't want to fight anybody, but you've invaded my home. The exit is blocked, and you can't stay here. I won't allow it. Only one thing to do. Dalv musters his fighting spirit. Feeling some Adventure Time vibes from this design, I have to say. Talk. Dalv does not seem to value communication. I don't suppose you can leave the way you entered, could you? That would be easier for the both of us. Oh my god, the lightning effect on the on the background on the environment. That's so cool. Handshake. Dalv doesn't notice your offer of goodwill. Where did you come from anyways? There aren't any accessible entrances. Oh! All I know is you somehow found me. Sorry to make things difficult, but I'm not cowering away this time. The other monsters, did you pester them as well? Not that I care much to keep up with their activity. Hey, I'm gaming here. Oh, this region of the ruins is my home, and my home has rules. The residents understand that. It seems as if you've never got the memo. That, or you're purposefully ignoring my wishes. Yeah, we're starting off slow on the difficulty. I can appreciate that. W what's with that sad face? Don't you understand? Don't you remember me? You 
you eat the candy corn. You now know why it was discarded. <laughs> I know you aren't a phantom, but could it be that? No, it isn't possible. You, you look so helpless, different. But is it a front? No, you aren't trying to hurt me. You, you aren't who I believed you to be, are you? How could I be so foolish? I apologize, I truly do. This got out of hand. I, I don't know how I can make things right now. Handshake. Valve accepts your offer of goodwill. You want me to shake your hand? Even after I wrongfully attacked you. But that is a sign of friendship, is it not? You're a human, right? Is it the same where you come from? I'm not sure. I didn't expect to meet another human, let alone befriend them. Don't get me wrong, I'd love to have a friend. I mean, I think. I don't really remember what that entails. I guess I'll give it a shot if you will. That startled me a bit. I'm not gonna lie. That scared me just a tiny bit. I, I don't know if I jumped or not, but it actually startled me. Do you want to, um, see my house or something? Something? I have to go there anyway, so I guess stop by if you have the time. I have to, um, fix something in the other room. Sit down, get comfortable, take your shoes off. Actually, please leave them on. The floors are a bit dirty. A bit dirty. Dirt. 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 I don't know, man. I haven't swept since this morning. Okay. <laughs> I didn't exactly have a huge selection of food. I don't get out much. Oh wait, I have some leftovers you can take with you. I hope you like it. I made it for my birthday. Sponge cake is my favorite. The sponge covered in frosting. <laughs> take it, absolutely. Ready to leave? Yep. If that's what you want, I'll lead the way. Well, here we are. Thank you for everything. You really have helped me out. Because of this, I'm leaving this place. I'm tired of being alone. It'll take a few days to pack up, but I think I'm ready to give the underground another shot. I have so much creativity I've been storing up. I'm finally ready to let my talent show. I can publish my novel, have an organ concert. I might even make another friend. What a world it would be if I had two whole friends. I'll go around and place corn on every doorstep. Everyone needs a little corn in their life. I've eaten corn every day for a year and I'm doing moderately okay. <laughs> so much to learn, so much to teach. I'm very excited. Oops, there I go again with my rambling. Let's get you out of here. Oh, it seems the exit is blocked off. Let's see. Hey! There we go. You're all set. Oh, before I forget, I never asked you for your name. Mind informing me? Clover. Clover? What a nice name. Well, Clover, thank you so much. They see you later, friend. I can tell that the genocide route for this game is going to be soul crushing. I can already tell. I just, I have a sinking feeling about future me just not having a very good time with this. You know what I mean? I'm going to do it. Don't get me wrong, but it's not going to be fun. It might be fun gameplay wise, but it's not going to be fun to watch like these wonderful people die. You know, it's, it's giving me Undertale vibes and obviously it's an Undertale fan game. It's a prequel to Undertale. Duh, it's giving me Undertale vibes. But I mean, specifically in like the tone that they're setting. They're giving me like uh, a reason to like these characters. They're endearing and cute and funny. And I can feel like, hey, me of the future, not going to have a great time killing these people. You know, so it's, it's, it's going to be fun gameplay, but not anything else. The original text of the sign was crossed out. Now it reads entry forbidden. Interesting. Howdy! Congratulations on being rid of those old ruins for good. You couldn't even go back if you wanted to now. Isn't the thought of fresh air exciting? Well, don't get ahead of yourself. You're still in the underground. We won't be anywhere near your fancy surface air for a while. Now let's get moving before my pedals freeze. Hop to it, bud. Actually, what was your name again? It isn't bud. It's gun hat that's right 
It is? Well, gun hat, enough talk. See ya. Hello. Hello, friend. Any secrets lie throughout these lands? It makes for a great and exciting honeymoon. Unfortunately, we're just a bit lost at the moment. He says he knows where we are, but I think he's just embarrassed. Any idea where we could get a map? We're not lost. I know exactly where we are. <laughs> okay, bud. There is an igloo here. Dance. You do a little dance. Someone has come out to investigate. Um, hi. Can I join? If you don't kill me, dance. Hey, we're dancing. Next time, I'll lead. Maybe you could stop attacking me and we could be friends. Oh, yeah. Okay, we are friends. Cool. Who's it gonna be? Oh, new character. Recalibrate the lava rock puzzle, check. Well, it should hold together for a few uses at least. And that's good enough for me. Next stop, Honeydew Resort. I have to say, I love the animation. Like the pixel animation in this game is so good. It's so, it, it's like, it's it's well done and it's like just builds into the characters being like endearing and different you know oh okay we gotta knock those down somehow to whom it may concern in accordance with royal guard guidebook section 4 paragraph 2 this puzzle isn't intended to impede the progress of an intruder probably you entertain the residents of the surrounding area snowed in and appear intimidating to would-be intruders or wrongdoers i'm unclear on what they mean by that just go with it Pass by this challenge, you must melt the ice cube. Make sure the ball thing gets to the bottom without breaking, though. Signed, Martlet, uh, Martlet, 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 Mar Marley, Marley, Martlet of the Underground Royal Guard. Okay. P.S. If one of those logs gets stuck, just jiggle it a little. I noticed it was sticking the other day, but you know how it is with DIY projects. Always something has to go wrong. So yeah, just a quick jiggle will do. P.P.P.P.P.S. I just realized you might not be able to reach the log to jiggle it. I mean, not everyone can fly or is freakishly tall, especially if you're a human or something. So just hope it doesn't get stuck. PPPS, I figured it out. If it gets stuck, just wait. I come around to inspect the puzzle quality every third day. Just hang out right here where you are for a day or two. Oh, and hope it doesn't get stuck. PPPPS, <laughs> I have been informed that the amount of PSs on the sign is unseemly. I am very sorry for any trouble they've caused. <laughs> Oh, you don't get up there. You just move it with your arrow keys. I see. Hey, I'm walking here. Let's go. Hello. Hey, you. Can you help me off this pole? <laughs> I didn't realize his tongue was stuck. I've been here for two hours now. Three dogs came up and dared me to lick it. Due to this cold weather, I'm now stuck. <laughs> My mom permitted me. <laughs> My mom permitted me back in time for month two. Please help. <laughs> Can I shoot it off? <laughs> Maybe some warm coffee will free my bone. <laughs> I'll be back, bud. Don't worry. Insomnitot. He just like me for real. Hypnotized. You swing Insomnitot's tassel in front of its face. I died. Are you serious? I fucking died? Are you joking with me? I didn't offer my help just to see you die. Let's get moving. Welcome back. <laughs> What's this? A new customer? Oh yeah, perfect. Bam! Who am I? Nobody a note, you know. 
Just the best darn salesman ever. Wham, I'm Mo. Anyways, the fact that you tried to get your mitts on this mug can only mean one thing. You're looking for a delicious little something to hit the spot, right? Of course, I know you're tight. So you want this here beverage? I do. No, you don't. Liquid Solar Season. Solid pass season before. You want to be fresh and revolutionary? I got the latest thing. Solids that used to be liquids and, you know, haven't been sitting out in the forest for three weeks. I've invented the next big thing here. For the incredibly low price of 15 gold, you can have your very own hot chocolate pop. It was once boring old hot chocolate, but now it's frozen to the perfect temperature. Have I piqued your interest yet? I'm sold. I knew you would be. Dang, I'm good. Let's get down to business. Here's what I got. Hot pop. Great choice. You enjoy that pop, buddy. Mm. Oh boy, oh gee, a customer, I'm nervous. I'm a male whale from the Underground Postal Service, so I hear you're new to the underground. How you ask? Well, word sure gets around. The underground is great and it keeps getting better, cause I brought for you your very first letter. <laughs> now I must be off, this mail mustn't be late. See you later on your journey, mate. Hey, watch it. Oh, 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 would you look at that? I think this chump wants to pass by. Swing Toast, come over here. Yeah, boss. What's up? You need to shave again? We got ourselves some fresh meat. Hi, hey, you ain't getting nowhere, small fry. Yeah, not anywhere. Will you two put a lid on it? <laughs> anyway, the name's Refill. I'm the boss of the world-renowned gang, the Shufflers. We rule this town. If you want to pass, you're going to have to go through us. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No need to start a fight. Let's be civil here. Do you attempt to attack everyone you encounter? Calm down, will you? Jeez, we shufflers prefer to settle things in a more dignified manner. You catch by drift. We would like to propose a challenge, a game of sorts. We'll take this ball here and hide it under one of us. Next, we'll shuffle around. When we finish, you'll have to guess who has the ball. We'll do this three times in a row. You win, you can pass. You lose, we'll sit here blocking you for all eternity. Here we go. All right, where's the ball? There it is. Two, three, two, three, two. Okay. Bro, I just did this for La Jupovania. Like, <laughs> there's no way I'm getting tripped up by a slower one. Boom. Boss, I think the little punk beat us. That must have been a lucky guess. There's no way a glass of spoiled milk like you could beat us. No, no, Toast, let's simmer down. There ain't nothing to get heated over. The kid beat us fair and square. The shufflers ain't nothing if not true to their word. Ain't that right? Yeah, boss. Shuffler always keeps their word. Yeah, always. Now, kid, we'll let you pass on through. You've earned yourself a powerful friend of the shufflers today. All you gotta do is remember the name, and we'll be on your side if you ever need us. The shufflers always protect a friend, right, boys? Yeah, you got a problem? We can handle it. Yeah, handle. I wish my left hand was as cozy as my right. Normally I have two mittens, so my warmth is symmetrical, but I think my left mitten took her a vacation or something. It just left me. Ha 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 Oh Yo <laughs> That didn't work out so well. Rich slippery during snowfall, no running. Nice, we're gaming. Coffee. Save the boy. I wish that I had enough for a honeydew pin. We might come back for that. I got you, bro. You take out the cup of coffee. Hey, what are you, crazy? That thing is thieving! So I need something hot, but not that hot. What do you want me to do, bro? 
I have no idea what you want, bro. I have no idea what you want me to do about that. Like, I'm sorry, but I tried, you know? <laughs> uh-huh. Ooh. There we go. We're back in business. secret i'm not actually an information kiosk i know this place like the back of my wing though i don't get lost much at all anymore i can get you wherever you want to go wait i'm gonna take a shot in the dark here but you're human right i knew it i knew i'd find a human you must be human right right you look just like this guy in the poster i saw once he had a hat just like you and he was totally human so like transitive property or something like that Actually, I think he was from space. Are there space humans? You know what? I'll have plenty of time to ask you questions later. Are you ready for some Royal Guard protocol? I hope you are, because I memorized it. Oh. Marlin of the Royal Guard has encountered a human. Prepare to apprehend. Protocol 1, be courteous and allow your opponent the first attack. I'm not attacking. You ignore Marlet's rambling. It doesn't look like she's noticed. Um, I don't think I'm supposed to be helping you, but that was supposed to be your turn. It's okay. I miss <laughs> space. I don't miss stuff like that all the time. I'll let you go again. <laughs> Marlet's blinking, blinking a lot. Maybe it's a code. It probably isn't. Uh, hold, hold on. I have a guidebook with me. I'll check what to do when someone doesn't actually attack. You can just, uh... <laughs> Take another turn, go for it, be as hard as you can. Okay, I'm really sorry for the wait. I'm looking, I'm not the best royal guard, you know, but I'm really trying to be better. Last week I had friend this girl, total human. Oh, I think it's your turn. Aha, uh -huh, royal guards are to proceed to the next step without hesitation. Oh, does that count as hesitation? What? Protocol two, my attack. Oh, kind of sick attack though. Wait, ow. Oh, we're taking damage though. That was only a warm up. Prepare for the Royal Guard Gauntlet. Oh, rush. You tap your wrist impatiently. Marlette looks apologetic and tries to talk a little faster. Hi, yeah. <laughs> Not too bad of an attack. Definitely unique and cool, though. You fake a yawn. Marlitz start, starts talking faster still. Take this, intruder! Oh, jeez. You tap your foot on the ground. Marlitz tries talking even faster. Oh. Oh. Oh, my God. It, it pushes you down when she flaps. Holy, I took so much damage. Um, hold on. I'm checking this one more time. That can't be right. You're not fighting back. I don't want to hurt you. You're all cute and stuff. You got to have your turn. I'm going to check my handbook again. See, when I apprehended that girl, I didn't have this problem. Well, I guess she didn't attack me per se, but she scolded me and got real aggressive. Like, what are you out about? I'm not human. Clear the feathers out of your head. Would you mind being aggressive like her? Come on, get aggressive. I can take it, I swear. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words can only make me sad. You called Marla. You called Marla a weenie. Oh, that was adorable. I don't even feel insulted. I feel like I've been honored. You put so much work into that. You are making this easy here. Here I go. Protocol and all that for the Royal Guard. Or you could just not. What if you just didn't and say you did, right? What if you just didn't? Counterpoint, stop. You forcibly tell Marla that you don't like her clothes. That's more like it. What kind of royal guard wears rags like these, right? It's not like I stayed up all night sewing them or anything. <laughs> oh, right, it's my turn. You, ins you insult Marlet's job performance. I have to say, you're not wrong about that one. I've kind of been on probation for a while. One more misstep and I could say goodbye to royal guarddom. 
and all the nice perks that come with it. My cozy uniforms, my royal card discount at the movies, my nice insurance rates. When they find out how much I hesitated here, I'm doomed. I mean, they specifically said, don't hesitate. I got it. <laughs> all right. <laughs> If the Royal Guard doesn't know you're here, they won't know I broke protocol. Instead, we'll just get you home before any of them see you. You'll be in, you'll be home in no time for dinner. I mean, maybe not today's dinner, but for sure a dinner. <laughs> anyway, we'll bypass the Royal Guard and plead your case to Asgore. There's no way he could say no to a cute little face like yours. Maybe up ahead and I'll show you my plan to get you home. Oh, man. Hey there, so here's the plan. I'm sorry, I think that I went a little overboard, but I can't help it. This is all too exciting. So I've been saving this for a rainy day. You know, figuratively, we don't really have those. Either way, behold, the UG Aviator. In the water sits an old-looking raft with just enough room for two passengers. Isn't she a beauty? Boats are she's, you know. I call her Ava for short. Isn't that cute? If my map and memory serve, this river should lead directly to Hotland. From there, there's a hop, skip, and a leap to Asgore's castle. I'm not sure how we're getting in, but we cross that bridge when we come to it, right? I also wanted to apologize about, well, you know, attacking you. I meant no harm, honest. I just, did, I just have to do my job is all. And well, oftentimes I don't know what the right action is until it's too late. So I know we just met and all, but will you trust me on this? Yes. Yay, don't worry, your trust is in good hands. Or wings, as this case may be. I'll guard it with my soul. And this means we can have an adventure. This is so exciting. I mean, nothing this exciting ever happens around here. At least while I've been here, it hasn't. Think of all the fun we'll have. I mean, there's a chance I might be fired for this and lose all of my life's work and belongings. But hey, what's life without a little risk? So shall we be off? Yeah, sure, we can leave. Are you coming? Wait, hold on. I was supposed to be on Ava with you. I mean, I guess you can fly, so. Oh, um, I might not have been down this route before. Hold on to something. Hey, look, it's Hotland. This is our stop. Wait, we have to talk here. Slow down. Well, rest in peace. Rest in peace, small child. Oh boy, that's... Hello, Clover, are you okay? Oh no, no, no. You stay right there, I'll go get help. Oh no, I'm alive, cool. Waterlogged remains of an old chest. You spy a small dry paper bag cradled in the interior of the lid. Will you take it? Absolutely. Trail mix, let's go. A container bearing a strange symbol. The lid is bolted shut. It's impossible to open. Howdy, Clover. What a day this has been. Thanks to that guard, we're free to totally, we're totally off course. It looks like she ditched you as well. I guess it can't be helped now. There's gotta be some other route to Asgore's castle here. Tough it out for now, we'll see where this new path takes us. A little excitement never hurt anyone. Well, except you. Let me heal you up. Okay. Northern Caverns up ahead. A box. I want to steal someone's Amazon delivery, bro. Come on. Wait. Dune bud. Oh, that was the one in the trailer. Pat. You cautiously pat on the top of the Dune bud. They seem confused. Oh? Uh -huh. Jiggle. You shake Dune bud back and forth. They giggle at you. Uh -huh. What? What is happening? Oh, it was a pail. Oh my god. Bro, chill. What? <laughs> Oh. Hey! Oh, look at his little face! Alright, what's down here first? Hello? I'm not up to anything suspicious, okay? There's no treasure behind this wall, okay? Don't rat me out, okay? 
This is my TNT, okay? I didn't steal it from my brother at the mines, okay? This X was here before I arrived, okay? The pain is still wet. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I can't stand storm this sandstorm. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. Oh my god. All right, Flowey. Howdy. Strange sight, huh? Who knew something could actually grow here? Anyway, great job so far. This place is much more treacherous than Snowden. Keep it up, Clover. What is going on here? Oh, it's our dude, Mo. What's good, man? <laughs> Bam. Guess who it is? That's right, it's Mo. Long time no see. How have you been? Don't answer that. We don't have the time. I'm here to make you a brand new offer. A hot climate calls for a hot item. Check it. That's right. I went all out this time. This is a real delicacy around here. It's called water. Catchy name, I know. Lucky for you, I'm giving out free samples. Want a glass? Yeah. Coming right up. One moment. If you know your boy Mo, you know I play a tall of that. Here's my real product, iced tea. It's like a sequel to water, way better. Now I'm gonna be real with you. The tea doesn't have ice in it particularly. It started as a glass of ice, but that melted. All I had to do was throw a tea back in there and wham. Don't worry, it tastes better this way. Here's what I got. Um, okay. Well, I... Bro, I don't have enough money. Alright? I don't have enough money for you. Hack Tony. Comes to share his pain. Avoid. You keep a safe distance between you and Hack Tony. What else is new? Getting deep naps to Blook vibes from this one. Hack Tony would like to cry, but it's too hot. It's so warm. Is this what love feels like? Pac Tony feels love for the first time. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> oh my god. Amazing. Turn it down. How do I unjam it? Maybe one of these guys will give me their. Oh. Oh yeah. Okay, cool. Awesome. Okay, we got the pickaxe. There we go. Pickaxe broke. Hey, what's good, bro? <laughs> Hi, how's it going? Mm, boom. The path has been opened. Ah! Run! Oh my god! Panic! Panic! <sighs> I'm alive. Yes, absolutely, I'm going in the rails. Are you kidding me? Let's go! It's beautiful. I really liked these kinds of, like, just, just shortcut scenes, you know? from uh, Undertale. I really, really liked them too. Ooh, puzzle. Boom. Some stale fruitcake sits in a bucket left over from a Mine Co. holiday party. Take it? Yes. Hello, visitor. Did you venture through the whole mine? What a journey. For your troubles, I'll let you in on a little secret. You see, we aren't mining for gemstones at all. Those things are everywhere, practically worthless. We're actually mining for minerals. <laughs> like this one in front of me. They're used for building materials around the underground, you see. They're also very... You saw nothing. To the mountaintop. You know, I'm kind of itching for a boss fight right about now. I can almost see the king's castle from here. <laughs> As Gore monsters shower him with praise, but it's totally overblown. See, he's what they call a boss monster. Means he has special traits. More power than the others. When you take him down, his soul will stay intact. But only for a moment before, boom, you win. I've heard the guy's immortal too. Can't age a second. At least not anymore. 
wild huh why are there machines pushing these i thought it was just a rock slide but these are it's a manufactured rock slide from hotland okay built to order by hotland mechanics signature of ownership north star so who is north star I'm trying to keep up like a facade for some reason but yeah flowey's giving me kind of weird vibes right now i'm not sure if we're gonna get blindsided or something but we'll see Hi. Holt, I, El Balador, have tasked myself with confrontation. The air is much too quiet, much too dreary. You make no, no noise when you move. You lack rhythm, feeling fervor. If I did not know any better, I might have mistaken you for a sentinel of silence. No, no, this will not do. You must prove to me that you have what it takes, what it takes to live a life of richness. I challenge you to dance. To truly find oneself, they must ignite a passion within. Let us duel! I want to see your spirit of fire. One and the two and... Uh... Oh my god, we're playing Guitar Hero. You clumsily spin around. El Bailador appreciates the effort. Oh, that, much, that was much too simple. Let us try this. Boom. I'm a bit of a gamer. I play Guitar Hero on Expert. Oh my god. That was terrible. That was terrible. I, I'm so not good at this yet. That feels so weird. You eat the pancake. The syrup is very sweet. You recover 16 HP. Let's go. A life without dance is empty, I say. Okay, getting a little bit better. I'm improving a little bit. Others say dance can also take life away. I do not see what they mean. We are trapped within a barrier with no hope for freedom. A sad, sad situation, but it is not sad for I. You press them at the same time, it feels a little more natural. We must make do with what we have. Find time for activities that make us happy. I'm outgoing because happiness is not a quiet virtue. I often encourage monsters and hope that it is contagious. So if you press the down arrow key with green, even though you don't need to, it again feels like a little bit more natural. Even if monster kind is cursed to this grim state, we must stick it out to the end, all the way up to the finale. Are we done? Nice. You've proven your passion, little one. Whew. I apologize if the dance was strenuous on your health. Sometimes having fun means having a few doctor's visits. However, it seems that you do not love dance as much as I. Perhaps you find happiness through other means. I've never considered that for quiet monsters such as you. Ah, uh, well, I at least hope your day has been brightened. I will wish you a fulfilling journey. Farewell. What a legend, dude. Dimensional satchel? Hello? Okay, so you can always access what's in your bag oh that's so cool or what's in the the box i mean that was actually awesome wow what a cool fight i i hope there's like a hard mode for this game because i really want to do a hard mode i feel like that would be really fun like there almost has to be right but yeah guys that's gonna be it for this episode of undertale yellow gonna be continuing either the neutral or pacifist route i guess uh assuming that there are those kinds of routes in this game in the next episode and then we'll dive into either hard mode if that exists or a genocide run in the episodes after that make sure to subscribe for more here and then check out this video youtube thinks you're gonna enjoy from the channel thanks so much for watching i hope you guys have a wonderful day and i will see you in the next one till then peace